So we're talking about the seven habits of highly effective people. The seven habits as, uh, as done by uh, or written by uh, St Stephen Covey. It's interesting that the second habit is called begin with the end in mind. It lets me think of when they start building a new complex or a new shopping center. Even before they start building, there's a big picture normally up of what the center will look like when it's done. That shows us what the end will look like before they even begin. So, if you want to start with the end in mind, what, what's the end that you want? To, what do you want to achieve? If you're studying, uh, studying a diploma or a degree, your your purpose will be to to actually start with the end in mind, and the end in mind would probably be, be a graduate or the end in mind would probably be a specific job that you want to do or a, spe a specific role you want to play in, in, in the world or the end in mind is what do you want to achieve with your life? Where do you see yourself in 5 years from now and 10 years from now, 15 years from now? What's the end that you have in mind? It's I interesting that um, the guy <coughs> that wrote a book, um, the book's name is Kazon, and um, he said that our life is just this short or this big, like a little line, because if you walk in a, in a, in a, in a graveyard, you will see that um, there'll, there'll be born a date when you were born and a date when the person passed away. And then in between is just a little line that little line is actually our life. That little line is actually the time we have on earth to make an impact, to change things. What is your end that you have in mind? What sort of life are you living? Are you living a life where you'll say it's like I'm living a great life or I'm just existing? Unfortunately, in today's life, there are so many people who's just existing. People who aren't just really, not really living. People who are like, oh no, it's Monday. Oh yes, it's Friday. I can't wait for Friday. Our lives are, are, are just, like, we're just wishing our lives away. We wish every day away. I want to go home. I, I just want to be home. And when I get home, I normally just watch TV and sleep. What sort of impact are you having on people's lives daily? What is the end that you have in mind? And, and that's why I would like to spend some time with, with you over the next few days reflecting on, on Stephen Covey's book, The End in Mind. Where do you see yourself in a few years' time? Where do you see your family in a few years' time? Where, is, where do you see your children? Or, your, or if, you're not, if you're not married or don't have children, where, where do you see your life? What is the end that you have in mind for yourself? For your family, for your people. Just think about that. Just a thought. Habit number two is begin with the end in mind. Where do you want to go with life? How's your journey going to end?